welcome to my channel. This is Carol Creamy B, and I'm here to give to you another look. I know it's been a while, but I've been through some things. So, we're back. Hopefully, we can keep it going. Pray for me, y'all. But anyway, I'm back to give you this look. And this is just a simple little look that I came up with. Nothing flashy. Just one of those ideas. I don't know what you would use it. If you would use it for a holiday look. Or just going out. Just something to do. Just to put on. So, this again is the look. And in this look, this time, I did went ahead and used my Huda Texture Shadow Palette Gold Gold Palette Edition. And this is a purchase from eBay. It is not the $65 purchase. That would be an offer. You know, this is, uh, this cost me $8 on eBay. And just to give you a quick look at it, these are the colors. Oh, did I have it upside down? Sorry, y'all. And it wasn't too bad. They didn't do too bad. Um, with some of the colors, it is kind of hard to use it on a brush. And um, while researching this palette, a lot of people did say it, and it is true. Whether it's a uh, knockoff or what. It, it is pretty hard to um, get on the palette. But the pigmentation of these colors for a knockoff is amazing. Amazing. I don't know if you can see them. But, yeah. Very amazing. So, I didn't mind this purchase too much. It did what it had to do. Just do a look, a quick look. And... I just wanted to see what the knockoff of it would look like. For $65, I figured the knockoff had to come somewhere close to being damn near good and perfect. But, again, it's a knockoff, so it did what it had to do. It gave me a look. And, again, I only paid $8, and it's available on eBay. Also, in this look, my foundation, I did went ahead and used a new foundation, which I am trying. And... This is the first for me because I actually, 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 for the first time, strayed away from my usual, which is my MAC foundation. And this time I went to the Maybelline, no, I'm sorry, the Revlon. And if you can just bear with me a moment here. <laughs> And the foundation that I did use for this look is the Revlon Color Stay in the color of Cappuccino. Now, the reason why I wanted to go ahead and try this one out, I've heard a lot of things about this, and I heard that it's a full coverage foundation and it's got staying powder. I also wanted to see if it actually would last 24 hours. And I, if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that I did a um, swatch on my wrist. And to tell you the truth, that sucker did last because I still had coverage on my wrist. And to wash it off is hell. Believe it. It is hell. This is something that I did purchase from Target. So, this was not nothing off of eBay. This is a straight purchase. And honey, it's got staying power. So, I did went ahead and use it as my foundation for this look. So... The usual standbys of the um, LA Girl Pro concealers, and so far, what I usually use my Laura Mercier to set the under eye, and that was basically it. So, to see how to get this look, let's go ahead and get into that video. But before we do, I'd like to again thank all my subscribers. <laughs> it's, it's the medicine, y'all. Oh, <laughs> My subscribers, just continue to ride with me and stick with me. The new subscribers, welcome to the family. And I hope I don't disappoint you. And don't forget to check out my last video, which is the giveaway. Read, make sure you read the description. And the rules are simple. Just like my fan page 
on Facebook and just put enter me. The winners of that giveaway will be selected from that video. So go ahead, take a look, see what we got going, and go ahead and mark it into me. So again, this is Carol Creamy, and we're gonna go ahead and get into this look. So 